Hello guys, what's up? This is a video made by me, Neil Ramos, YouTube producer, and today I'm going to teach you how you can program uh, an Inver Hello 2 hopper, pinball loader. So you have the the top light, and you have just one single button to program. Okay, if you press it on, it'll go green, and it will just stay like that. Uh, if you try to press it like fast, it's not going to get you anywhere, it's just going to stay like that. So, what you want to do to program, just push the button all the way until the light goes red, it means that you are turning it off. So, lights are off, her, the pinball hopper is off. So, we are going to just push the button and we are going to push it as soon as the color appear, appears. So it may scroll into the settings option. So we are going to, just going to press it. We are going to press it again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, five, one. Okay. Green light, yellow light, red light. Okay. What this does is that um, green light means the speed setting. The higher your setting, the faster your loader will feed. The yellow is the sensitivity, and and when your marker start, starts firing, the higher the sensitivity, the faster it will react to the sounds, and it will feed the the paintballs. The red one is the stack, so you that's the ball stack pressure on the on the red light, so. So we are just going to change the settings. So we, after we turn it on, we are going to push the button after the green light appears. Okay, we push it on. It will show me the settings on the green, the yellow, and the red. When the buttons blink on the color, you are going to press it. Okay, it appears green, so we are going to press it. And the number of the of the buttons that we push is the setting that we are going to use. So. I'm going to change the green setting so we are just going to turn it on and we press the button it will scroll down to the settings we, you are going to wait until the green color appears okay green we push it okay we want to press one two three and four it will show you the settings in green I have one two three and four it will scroll down to the other one and it will scroll down to the red one so you have to be a little quick to to program them so after you turn it on you have your new settings complete so I have green settings on 4 so let me just uh, show you we press the button to turn it on and we press the button again after the green light appears 1, 2, 3, 4 one two three four five and in the red one so we're going to put red and yellow let's change the sensitivity okay one two three four five six one two three four five six that's the sensitivity option after you have done done setting the after you setting your color it will scroll to the other color which you can push the button so you can adjust what kind of settings do you want the green button has six settings from setting one to setting six that goes to the sensitivity settings as well and the red one which is the ball stack pressure it will go all the way up to one to two so so I'm going to change the settings for the for let's say the green again I'm going to turn the hopper on and I'm going to press the button as soon as the green light appears okay there we go one two three four it will show you my yellow settings and my red settings it will show me the color I push the button and I will set it push the button one two three four five and six one two three four five six we have green on the highest setting which is number six and basically that's how you change the settings it's not that complicated you just have to be 
a, li a little quick that's it so it's not really that hard so okay we have one two three four five six on setting the motor stack one two three four five six let's change the red one okay we have green yellow and red we push the button okay we're just going to push one and two the red the red setting on the ball stack it's on setting one two so basically that's it when when you're about to turn your hopper on just push the button when the green light appears and it will scroll to your settings options and then when the green and the, the, when the colors appear you push the button and set your settings on the number of the buttons that you click okay let's set it one two and three we should be in setting three one two three okay let me change it to one after the the color scroll you can change them as well I recommend uh, setting uh, four the green color for the speed six for the sensitivity settings and one for the ball stack so this is basically it this is how you can program your Inver Halo 2 I tried to make it as simple as possible and there's a neighbor that's passing the trimmer, the grass cutting. So anyway, just comment, like, subscribe. Once again, thank you for your support. You guys are awesome. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.